Hey guys, Taco Monkey here, staying classy. So, we're going to continue on where we left off. Uh, there was a Scarab up here with an Ashy War. I killed it already. It's kind of dealing with something. So, then we got our giant. So, what you want to do is, to get this giant to come, you tick him off. And you run. He's going to follow. He's the guy that's going to get us the rune we're looking for. Oh, come on, guy. Oh, he's still here. Okay, I thought he was gone. He is not gone. Did he just kill the bird? Nice. Okay. So, keep him coming. Keep him coming. Keep him coming. And run on right over here. Yep. And he's going to mess some guys up. He's just going to run right over here. Nope. Jump. Jump. Oh, come on now. And we're gonna get out of the way. Okay. Let them deal with their problem. There we go. He gave us the smithing stone one and two. And then... Okay, it's not worth it. It's not worth it. As close as I am to killing him, it's just not worth it. Nope, not worth it at all. So we're just going to run on over here, grab this that I was talking about before. Just a smithing stone. Oh, he killed us both. Oh, what a, what a jerk. What a jerk. Just, just a not nice guy at all. And that's okay. We're still right here. Now, before we continue on, we got a couple things we got to do. Up here. Crack pot for my pot throwers. Another crack pot for my pot throwers. Okay, ignore these guys. Run on over. There is a little secret over here, though. That's not it. <laughs> Holding circle and pressing X, you'll jump right up here, fall along the wall, and you got a little secret. Oh! Oh, you come on, man. What is with me today, guys? I apologize. Just, I am not, I haven't had enough tacos lately. I need some more tacos. I've been playing a lot of Dying Light, so that's probably, it, it, switching games messes me up sometimes. So this is a nice little jump over secret. It really doesn't get you too much further. 
Um, nothing too spectacular. So you can come right up here, and then you're up on top above these guys. Go up here. Get a nice smithing stone too. It's a, I guess this is a decent secret. Then you can come over here. Golden rune. Smithing stone one. Turn you to flower. And a cute butt from my wife. Ah, uh, my wife just walked in. Lovely, lovely lady. Oh, that's where these guys were. They can shoot you when you're through here. So, come on down. See, I'm not seeing, I'm not seeing the benefit from this. I'm going to be honest with you. The final chain of the attack seems better. Uh, I keep, see, I like PlayStation, but it's got this. I don't like the way I do the point thing. Oh, the Manor Tower. Now that's decent. That's a decent critical shield. Oh, that is killing faster. Okay, so we're better off with the Twin Blade Talson. So, at any rate. Uh, right here, you got the Manor Tower Shield. You need 30 strength, but the physical damage is outstanding. And the magic protection, just, just great. Um, so you come on out here. Smithing Stone 3, fellas. And you can get a special thing. Surely, what you seek is somewhere close by. Um, this is a very, very scary secret. So this gets you to a Crucible Knight that just sucks. It just sucks. Come in here, come over here. I guess this was a decent secret, and here is your secret door. I haven't done this in a while, folks. So it's kind of interesting that I went this way with you guys. Great thing is we can upgrade our flask one more time. Never hurts. So at this point you should have six, seven, you should have eight total. Um since Ah, oh, we're going to keep it like it is. We're going to add one more to blue next. I like to have six health with this build. Um, as you see, that's the way down to what? Wait, what? I don't remember. I don't remember this, guys. Interesting. I remember it vaguely. Arterial leaf, that's great for our St. Trinia arrows. Man, there are some cool little fun places in this. Now for the bats, just, just sling the blood. That's the way to go. See, that just gets them real easy. Oh, we're kind of discovering this together, to be honest. Let's see what's over here. Find out together. Okay, and that's where you would drop down, right up there. So right above us is where you drop down for the secret. There's a secret boss down here that, incidentally, you do not have to fight. Um, I wouldn't suggest it this soon, personally. Um, depending if you're a strength build, magic build maybe, but not a bandit build. Come on now. There's the blood. Blood damage. Yeah, and that's why we have that. 
So at any rate, man, I got really, I gotta get better with this build. I'm digging it, but it's very experimental. Poison Blossom, there is a Scarab, obviously. Cranker Call, decent for a dark flame magic. Um, I like it. Not everyone likes it. I like the targeting in it. Balls guys for easy. A lot of people say it's not that great, but if you got a good build, anything's decent in this game. I got to be honest with you. Go with what you like. So you got one, two, three little pieces of candy, and that way, that's where you want to go. As soon as you get down here, this thing's going to come up, and I can't stand these guys at all. Okay, see, and that's why. So we're going to get the Storm So Key. We're going to grab this. No, oh my gosh, really? Throwing daggers. Uh, let's see. Yeah, nope. Not going to happen. So we're just going to run on through. Run, run, run. Oh my god. Oh, really? 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 Run, 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 run. Grab this. Prince of Death. Pustule. That's for your vitality. Basically, it's for when you're trying to... Aw, oh, you dicks. Um, <laughs> it's when you're trying to protect yourself against death. Um, that's what that's for. Man, just not not getting good with this today. Just to show you where we would have ended up. The way I would have came this way. I would have. Used this action's approach. And just drop down. And that's the other side with the bats. I guess you can just jump across there. No, you can't. Wouldn't happen. So at any rate. I'm I'm so sick of getting hurt in this. It is hard to be a bandit in this, at least with this armor. I want to get the Black Knife armor set, but that is going to be a trek. I am going to go for it eventually for you guys. Try it out, but it's not going to be easy sell. Just keep on running. Get runes back and go right up here. I am, okay, you know what? Taking that away, because I'm sick of pressing that button. That's a long ladder. I mean, you gotta say, that's that's a pretty long way up. Really? Guess you can't equip your lantern when you're on the ladder. I didn't know that. Come. All right. So you come back up here. That's where you would have went down for the one special area you were in. Just run over here. There's the dogs. Now it's all together. So, back over here. We've looked at everything. Everything I know of, anyway. Uh, time to get on Godric and finish him off. It will let me... Ooh, it's going to let me... Skip ahead. I did not know that one, either. So, before we continue, this is Nephili. You can equip, you can uh, summon her, she'll help you out. She's got two, two axes, pretty cool. Right now, we're going to go back over. Let's see about upgrading our armaments again, so they don't suck. So the 
Bravo. <coughs> she needs Sovereign for that one. Not worried about it. We'll upgrade that eventually. Get the Smithing Stone so that's a little upgraded. Now we're doing some damage, guys. Now we should have a lot better time. Um, now we should have a lot better time. Back to Seclude Cell. And just to show you how much of a better time, we'll go to the jars, I'll show you. Now to see the better timing that we're going to have. up in the air. See the difference? Much better. Three clicks. Done. Now we're ki now we're coasting. Okay. So we'll go back to Seclude Cell and we'll go for uh, Godric. Get her into Felly. Now for this one, I'm going to say switch. Um, at least with these, they'll keep resummoning. I would switch that for a beginner. Throw a tier on. Now this just for the case. Let's make all the flesh. Let's go for it. Uh, everyone's seen this. Oh, I'm out. Can I sleep him? Can, but she woke him up. Just run towards him. Again, jump towards him. And there's your blood damage. There's your blood damage. See how the guy, the blood just runs through him. And that's how you do it. See, that's the extent of this build. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you got God Edward's Great Seal, Remembrance of the Grafted, and some pieces of candy. The Felly will return back to round table hold. Go ahead and sleep. Sleep, whatever you want to call it. And we, oh, we are able to upgrade again. Level up. Again, we're going to go intelligence again. One more and we can use the bow properly. And then we'll be better at range. Here's the guy that's stealing your runes. Again, don't kill him. Because once you get that opened up with the Felly, they become lords, and you're good to go. He got what I tell you, though. He had... 
man, I don't like this guy. Um, if you're here, obviously you already have the bandit stuff. You can use the rest of the runes to buy some pinions if you want. Stormheart Feather is always useful. And we go on through. Now, down here, there's not much. This is where Nefeli and that jerk will appear. Um, also with Hedrick, uh, for those of you who don't remember, that's right over here. He will help you, or Hyatt is his name, right? Yes, Hyatt. Hedrick, sorry about that. Hedrick, as long as you got him here, when you go through there, you're good to go. Um, you'll go back there later as you carry on with Nefeli's quest. There's not much in here. It's basically another round table hold kind of deal. Uh, mock ramp table hold. It's like allows you to attack that doesn't allow you to attack. I don't know why. It's kind of weird. But you're going to fall down. Come over here. You're going to have a shiv shivery grape. Uh, basically, it's an eye. Uh, a chaos eye of the frenzy flame. So, come out here. And you're going to see her. Here, ignore her, and you're going to go right here. rest and you'll save it so from there we're going to stop we're going to move on later through learning of the lakes um right here still water for those of you that need to know Silver cave is just pretty much right right down here uh really far down here right there is some tombstones we'll be able to go down and get down there and that's where we're going to be going next we'll get the ability to attack five times and they get more more power when you attack so this attack will do a lot of damage um and then so on and so forth there's relicaria we're going to be heading that way and yeah so there's learning the lakes not a fun place man the evangel looks really big from here i never really looked through here it's pretty cool all right, so thank you very much. Uh, you guys like, subscribe. Please let me know some things that you want me to do. I will do it. Uh, it really helps the channel out. Have fun. Enjoy what you do. And uh, stay classy.